What's up, everybody? Can you hear me? Just checking real quick. Okay, okay, okay. What's up, what's up? Test, test, test. Alright, perfect. Uh, about to start. You're the first, James. About to start. Okay, we're gonna set up TikTok. We're gonna set up this. Um, so... We've shared it very, uh, James, you might be one of the few to be watching uh, on YouTube because we just shared it like super uh, last minute. Um, just so you know. Okay. Um, what else? Okay. Um, I want that. Get out of here. <laughs> um, Joe Exotic. There we go. Okay, we are live everywhere right now. This is the first time I'm live on separate channels, guys. That's pretty cool. Um, so I'm gonna look uh, to different, different uh, streams. Um, okay. What's up, Michael? You were the first. Um, we are on YouTube, we are on TikTok, we are everywhere. Um, so today's topic is going to be, da -da -da -da. if you know, you know, if you check my Instagram, you are watching on YouTube, you can see me from here. If you are on TikTok, you can see me here. What's up, TikTok? What's up, YouTube? Uh, sorry that I shared it so late. Uh, Super Ninka, Topper, Michelle, Michelle just joined. Amazing. So uh, are you on YouTube or you're on TikTok or maybe you're on both? Let me know. Um, okay. So there we go. Um, okay, we're going to start uh, for the YouTube guys. What's up, everybody? We're going to start with, um, let me see. We're going to start with the video here with the latest Tiger Tales update. Every time we share a new Tiger Tales update. So here we go here on the 19 years of allegations of abuse and neglect and wildlife in need in southern Indiana, all pointing to one man and his exotic animals. Our focus team took those allegations to the USDA, and this week the feds ordered Tim Stark to cease and desist. Tonight, Shay McAllister continues her investigation with a trip to Charlestown, Indiana, to meet with Stark. In a profanity-riddled interview, he blames everyone else. Guys, this is about Joe Exotic. Two tall iron gates greet you at the edge of Tim Stark's facility. Posters warn intruders to keep their distance. Hi, Shereen. What's up? Tim Stark knew we were coming. How are you doing? And he invited us in. Am I perfect? Hell no, I'm not. Don't claim to be, don't want to be. But I stand my ground that my animals are taken care of. I do not abuse animals. I do not neglect animals. We talked to seven whistleblowers with serious accusations, up, describing moldy food, lack of water, dirty cages, and ailments that don't receive vet care. Stark says the so explanation guys, is simple. Uh, let me they pause it real quick. Uh, we're job. looking at uh, the new investigation of Tiger King, Tim Stark, Wildlife in Need. Okay. So last week we're gonna like talk about some updates about Joe Exotic. Um, I'm good, thank you, Shireen, appreciate it. Um, I just want to share like the new video that I haven't seen as well, so that you know what we're watching. Then they want to point the finger at me because they're worthless pieces of shit and they didn't do their job. They would come to me and an animal's already pretty much sitting laying there on his deathbed, uh, and I'm like, what the hell? Why wasn't this reported to me two or three days ago? Well, we didn't look 
look at it, we didn't see it. You know, so in other words, you didn't do your damn job. He points the finger at his staff, but USDA inspection reports support their claims. Are the inspection reports wrong? What's up? Most of them, yes. Yeah. More specifically, he blames it. bad inspection reports on one specific inspector. I couldn't understand half the to come out of his mouth. Any questions about the one thing I did understand was, oh, this is out of compliance, that out of compliance, oh, you did, uh, uh, so you know, and I'm standing there like, the, what the uh, are you talking about? How do you go from perfect record to all of a sudden like an 18-page write-up? Stark says That's it right. was difficult to get clarification from the government agency. He didn't always know what needed to be fixed. You want me to abide by oh, regulations yeah. or laws? Oh, then give God. me those You're regulations and laws and shut the, the up. up. You if you think something's out of compliance, show it to me and I'll fix it immediately. But I will not tolerate somebody yes, coming yes, here and yes. just telling me, oh, this any, is wrong or that's wrong, you gotta fix this, you gotta fix that, because I said so. We asked Stark about certain incidents, like the January 2016 fire that killed at least 40 animals. That's the beginning of my PETA war. You think PETA started the fire? Damn right I do. And we've got proof that PETA started fires all over the country. Do you have any proof that they started the fire here? No. Nope. But I, I don't have a problem accusing them. It. He also blames PETA you for an incident with tiger cubs. Joe Exotic, According why? to USDA paperwork, the Were facility's vet declawed the cubs at Stark? wildlife in need. Their paws became infected. Stark says then the vet was out about? of the country. The cubs ultimately died. You know, the accusations that they made about the tiger cubs that were injured and ended up dead. So well, guess what? Loves you. Look, I'm a man. Damn, I had a I won't undercover that. spy here on my property. I won't remember that. Wonder why and how all so that to, happened uh, then. So are you saying that he was Instagram. the reason those cubs died? You goddamn right he was. Uh, this is about what Joe Exotic, do? guys. Don't know. If we knew that, it'd all be done and over with. We reached out to PETA about the accusations. They sent us a statement citing a federal judge ruling where Stark's vet admits to declawing the tiger cubs. Love Love the statement goes on to say, his claims about PETA are, quite obviously, false. Tim Stark calls most of the accusations against him hearsay. He says there's no evidence to back Future them up. Exotic, yes. Would you say all of your animals live in a safe habitat? Working hard, guys. Yeah, because they don't get hurt in their habitat. Well, it safe. Against, uh, is it appropriate system. for each of the Matrix. animal types? Yes. And would you be willing to show us that? No. Free Why not? Exotic, guys. Because you reporters suck. I guess that's the simplest way to put that. He also refused to show us proof that he rehabilitates and releases animals, like his website claims. How many animals have yes, you rehabilitated Joe. and released? Absolutely. Over all the years? Oh, hell, thousands uh, and thousands. And do you have any written Tate proof, Brothers, documents, videos of that? Out. Yeah. Bobby, is I it easy to see? Bobby. Do you share it with people? No. You know what is business. He wouldn't show us proof of how many animals he saved. He also more. wouldn't elaborate on how he kills. We asked after reading a USDA inspection report detailing a discussion with Stark. Two years. Two years Stark admitting to inspectors he, well, quote, euthanized a snow like, leopard uh, by beating it with a baseball bat okay. multiple okay, times. So I'm going to pause this real quick here, guys, uh, because this is about uh, the new investigation about Tim, uh, Tiger King's Tim Stark. If you have not seen it, um, you know, uh, you will have to. Um... And, uh, okay, let me, let me switch back and forth here. Okay, first, is there any questions here? Um, I do think it's important. Uh, yes, it's super important. So what are we doing? For two years, uh, I've been helping Joe Exotic. I've been communicating with him from prison. Uh, basically, he's, uh, he's in there for murder for love for hire, right? And, um, uh, like, People ask me here, like, about what about the execution of tigers? Well, you have to understand, like, first of all, we need to look at the evidence. We need to look at where we are, okay? Also, do you understand and have you, ever, have you even looked into it? Do you know that the people that testified against him actually lied? Do you know that the FBI set up the murder plot for hire? So he was, like, kind of, like, set up. These are things you need to look at. And also, a question to you and to you. What if you would have people around you that testified against you? People close to you, your friends, family, whatever, okay, that you work with, that you have a friendship with, or even your own ex-husband or ex-wife, whatever. I mean, back then it was still his husband, by the way, talking about Joe Exotic. 
So as an example, okay, as an example, wouldn't you want people like your dates or me or like, you know, to kind of like help to get out? I certainly would. All right. So that's what we're doing here. We're creating consciousness. We're creating like, you know, we're talking about. Uh, well, that's good. Um, I mean, listen, um, what are we talking about? We're talking about Joe Exotic. We're talking about Joe Exotic. Um, and uh, yes. Yeah. So listen, let me talk. Let me talk a little bit about real quick why I am doing both. First of all, uh, YouTube is rather new. Um, so like the great thing about YouTube is I can pull up videos and I can like kind of like interact more easy. Um, and here it's like just like this frame and I can really see the comments good and I can answer your questions here. And I had, uh, I've been challenged to do 30 days of live on TikTok. So that's why you see me every day now on TikTok because you keep challenging me to do all this crazy stuff. So now I'm here every night at 11 p.m. Yes, it's 11 p.m. here in Spain. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's for a good cause, free Joe exotic. All right. Um, let me see. Uh, I don't have a mild filter. That is true. And I'm not blocking you either. If you want to talk some shit, I always say it, do it. Uh, as long as you are here and you keep talking and spreading the word and, uh, allow me to live rent free or live Joe exotic rent free. Um, that's good. Okay. Um, I will not stop trying to get innocent people out of prison. Uh, what is your name? Me is your name. Okay. Uh, why is that? Because I think that, uh, after living in the U S and after visiting and after, you know, knowing what happened to Joe exotic and it, this, this goes for anybody. It's not just Joe. It's like anybody that is in prison and should not be there because they're innocent. They need to be helped legally every single way that we can. All right. Um, uh, well, because you don't live here. Oh, oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. I lived in Manhattan. You want to see my old neighborhood? I love it. Cut my steak. Um, if it's a good steak, yes. If not, then forget about it. Uh, Matt Getty. Uh, he's in Kim K area. Uh, waarom Spanje geen Amsterdam? Why am I in Amsterdam? I'm not, it's, uh, I'm back and forth. I'm still, uh, <laughs> I'm still back and forth of course i don't want to leave amsterdam all right uh guys joe exotic questions please joe exotic questions you're distracting me uh hi alina um okay so this is the latest and as you can see here my my friend uh john phillips he has a lot of videos about tiger tail he's doing an incredible job um Magdaddy, uh, if it's not a good steak, I don't, I want not. Uh, Hola, como estas? You want me to speak Spanish? Um, so there's also a 40 minute video here on uh, Tim, Tim Stark, like threatening. Um, and here two months ago, if you have not, an update from Joe Exotic. Let's play that as well. Okay, there we go. Hey everybody, it's Joe. Hey, uh, my appeal arguments are in two days, just this Thursday on the 29th. And um, Molly Palmer and, and John Phillips and Amy Anna and the whole crew is, is going to go and, and fight for my life once again. And then I guess we're going to sit around and wait for a while until we get a decision. And then we got to wait for even longer to get uh, back on a docket so I can go back to Oklahoma and probably just get screwed over again. But anyway, I appreciate everybody's you, Tiffany, support. Appreciate it. And uh, I'm just keep up the fight. Keep up passing Sorry, around the man. petition so we can get some signatures on the petition. But we got to make this political because I'm never going to get out of any other way because uh, it's too corrupt. The whole system is too corrupt. And uh, don't believe all the bullshit that you are seeing out, out there right now because it's all crap. And... Uh, one day, John Phillips is going to clean it all up for us. So he works his ass off. We're going to we're going to deal with a, a few other things here in the very near future. But anyway, uh, y'all be nice to set that there. Some of, some of these people can be really hateful, but uh, the guy has been there for me for going on two years now. So respect him, please. Thank respect you, me and respect John Phillips and his crew and. I appreciate it. Nancy I love Chang. each and every one of you. Okay. 
so this happened, right? We watched um, the trial, the, the, the oral hearing. It happened. Uh, we've seen it. Uh, thank you, Rayo. Appreciate it. Miriam from Dag, thank you for the rose. Uh, uh, appreciate it. So, uh, what I what I just show is like this has happened, right? And I, okay, let me. Ah, I can see the comments here. You cannot hear me, James. Can you hear me better now? Uh, this is for YouTube, by the way. Can you hear me better now? Let me know. You become a lawyer and get him out. Oi, Marcia. Thank you very much. We have two cowboy hats. Let's go. Um, um, let me know if you... You're struggling to hear me. That's so crazy, guys. Is this better? I put it on max. Ah, perfect. Okay. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Um, okay. Let's focus. Let please, uh, TikTok. Let's focus on Joe Exotic for a second. Okay. Um, so we're seeing the oral hearing and what is your, what is your opinion? Um, what do you think? It, do you think it's realistic that, um, Joe Biden is, is able to pardon and willing to pardon Joe Exotic. Yes or no? That is my question. TikTok, YouTube, let me know. Goedenavond, Grace. Good to see you. Amsterdam and Gekste, 100%. Yes. Uh, yes, yes, correct. Okay, good. So this is the way to, to, to make that happen. Thank you, Tessa. I appreciate it that uh, rose um and monica for the wishing bottle uh monica again um this is what's happening okay where obviously john phillips is fighting very hard for his case and at the same time joe's exotic uh, joe joe's health is not that great right now right so i speak to him a lot um from prison and it's very really very challenging because there's such a big time difference right so right now it's like 11 11 11 it's 11-11. 11, 11. Okay. Um, but usually he calls it at midnight. So I'm trying to stay up and then sometimes I miss him. And when I do speak to him, his health is not good. Okay. So please understand that you, you, everybody that is involved with supporting him or writing him letters or sending him gifts, okay, or buying like a, like a gift is indirectly or directly helping him. Because because of you, um, you have to understand that he keeps the hope up. He keeps the energy alive. This is not horseshit, Janine. This is true. Why do you why 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 you be so negative? When you're so negative, you attract negative energy. Have you, I bet you Janine has not seen any Tiger Tail story, has not looked into the evidence for Joe Exotic, and that now Joe Janine here is like saying this that it's horseshit. It's not horseshit, okay? Um oh my god, my battery is about to die. Um, okay. So, um, okay. So his health, thank you, Miriam. Appreciate it. Um, into all this. What is it? Okay. Good question. How did I get into this? That's a really good question. Okay. So Joe Exotic. Two years ago, we did a podcast with his now ex-husband, okay, Dylan. Supporting him, obviously, um, back then, because I knew what happened. And I think it's unfair that, oh, oh, we're just super entertaining. He does the show and, uh, you know, we're in lockdown or whatever. And then the lockdown is over. Oh, let's forget about Joe Exotic. Let him be in prison. He, you know, we don't care. come on. Like, th this is what I don't like. Thank you, Elizabeth. You're talking to me, you're a fan. You're a Joe Exotic fan. Tiger King, this, that, that. Viral. You're not a fan of Joe Exotic. You just was entertained and distracted you from the lockdown. Don't come at me saying you're a fan of Joe Exotic when you're not supporting him. For two years, I haven't gotten anything from it. I've done it because I love that man. And I don't care what you think about Joe Exotic. I don't care what you think about his style. He might be controversial. He might be this, whatever. But this man was a good man. 
all right? It was a good man. YouTube, it was a good man. TikTok, it was a good man. And he still is. And he's still trying to keep his hopes up because of you, because of you, because of what we do. If he doesn't have us, do you think he's, he has something to fight for? He has nothing to fight for. Imagine you, you being in prison. You have people around you that testify against you. They make up some story. Do you, would you, imagine you being alone. Nobody looking out for you. Nobody speaking up for you. You're going to die in prison. Think about this, guys. Every year I do a good cause. This year I'm fighting against the justice system. It's not easy. And again, this is not just about Joe Exotic. There's multiple people that are innocently in jail. I've been accused of false things. You've been accused of false things. Everybody has dealt with that on a smaller scale. But imagine that happening so you get into prison. Okay, I'm sorry. Sorry about my jacket. Thank you, uh, Brittany. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, girl, you cray cray. Okay. Um, thank you. Joe is cute. Yes, he is cute. Uh, <laughs> I love you guys. Okay. So, um, you know what I'm going to do next time? Because all these steak questions. Next time we're going live. Maybe not next time because I just had steak. Um, but I'm going to get a steak and I'm going to make sure I show everybody how to cut steak. All right. And maybe we should include a tiger. So we have more like, you know, what's up Tessa? Thank you for the roses. Appreciate it. Okay. We bring a tiger in here, a little baby tiger that can eat the steak for you to watch. I'll cut it for you. I'll show you. Okay. So, all right. Jesus, man. I cut the steak. How to cut the steak. How to, like, come on, man. Um, all right, so um, Sandra, thank you, Miriam. From the, Miriam, Miriam, appreciate it. Thank you, Laila. Fine avond, uh, Inge, Inge Weine. Um, so, do you understand? Do you understand what I'm saying about like the justice system and that we have to free, like you know, stand up for people that are done wrong? So that's what I'm saying. Like, it doesn't matter what you think of somebody. What matters is that you stand up for human rights. That is what should matter. And yes, you happen to watch Tiger King during lockdown. You happen to be enjoyed, entertained. Where are you now? Where are you now? What are you doing? Okay, I'm on the phone with him. Sometimes I stay up till 3 a.m. in the morning. If he doesn't have that, do you think he would still be here now? He's deteriorating, guys. I speak to him. His health is not good. He asked me to be a spokesperson because I don't want anything. I don't want any gain from it. Everybody's taking from him, like like money. For two years, I've been supporting. Didn't want anything. Now I'm more on the forefront. I didn't want this. I didn't want to be on the forefront. But here I am. Because who else is doing it? You know? Uh, that's okay, Mega. You can mock me. Uh, you're on my life to mock me. Okay, welcome. I don't, I'm not going to block you. You can do that. That's fine. Welcome. Um, Elizabeth, thank you. Hello from Texas. I love Texas. So, um, that's it guys. Uh, my battery is going to die for YouTube. So, um, I'm going to, I'm going to cut this stream off. Um, Miriam, thank you. You're the best. Uh, how are we supposed to know? Okay. This is a good question. How are we supposed to know that, that he's innocent? Okay. Go to my YouTube. I shared the target deals. I shared the evidence on one of my lives as well. Um, and I, you can even watch it, like all the new evidence. There's testimonies now. There's people that lied. They, they, they made a false testimony. We have that proof. So again, it's important that you look into it. All right. Love you guys. Um, so if, by the way, if you want to um, come from YouTube to TikTok, um, make sure to, uh, to, to switch over. All right. Thank you, guys. I have to cut this one because of the, the battery of my MacBook. Um, Okay, 